Okay, we're talking about what's good this morning. How about a part-time car mechanic in South Carolina who really takes the old adage, one man's junk is another man's treasure to heart, fixing junk cars, providing reliable transportation for those in need. He sounds like an angel. Elliot Middleton has a full-time job. He owns Middleton's Village Barbecue in Awanda, South Carolina. Uh, and this is very, very cool. Not long ago, this former mechanic was trading ribs for Rex, literally. Uh, Elliot joining us live. Good morning to you. Good morning. How are you doing? Oh, we're amazing. So, first of all, you run a restaurant. That is not a light work. How in the world did you find spare time to fix clunkers and, and give them to people without transportation? Yes, ma'am. So uh, the restaurant pretty much operates from Wednesday through Sunday, pretty much 12 until a little bit after 8 p.m. Um, through the weekend and on the weekends until about 10 or 11. So my Mondays and Tuesdays was pretty much not at the restaurant. And I just pretty much started using those days to, uh, you know, collect cars, repair them, and, and donate them to folks in need. You've repaired more than 30 cars so far just in 2021. What inspired you to do this? Well, back in uh, 2019, um, small town right not too far from me, Andrew, South Carolina, I held a food drive there. And for me to just see the folks that was not able to get to the food drive because of a lack of transportation, I felt that, you know, being a mechanic for over 17 years, that I can help out in that area and help those folks uh, to be able to have transportation. And how and, do you uh, find after, families? How do you find the people who need them? Uh, boots on the ground, um, pretty much like contacting with mayors and church members and community leaders and stuff like that, and just trying to figure out exactly like, hey, do you know someone that may need a car and representation of the community? I, I just love your story so much. Uh, is this just you fixing the cars or do people help you? So I have one other mechanic. His name is Matthew Poston. He's been with me since day one. Um, he helps me repair the cars. And, um, you know, pretty much a lot of guys, a lot of friends help me towing the cars as well. And, and are the cars donated from a particular group or, or people saying, you know, I don't need this car. Let me. They heard about you in the town that you live in or? Well, it first started off with a Facebook post in uh, 2020. Um, offering ribs for the cars, and I started getting a few cars here and there. But now, recently, since uh, you know everything's been going on, you know there's been cars donated from all over the nation. Um, I've been able to travel outside of my state to pick up some cars. Though, of course, traveling so far is hard to pick them up. But um, yeah, cars are being donated from all over. So a lot of people are inspired. Well, Elliot, I am sending you a big hu virtual hugs for doing this. I, I think that this is a game changer and such an encouragement to those who need it. Thank you for the hard work that you're doing. And I, I really am going to have to try some barbecue oh, one of these God, days. Oh, God, that looks good. <laughs> from South Carolina, too. So we're going to, like, visit you one day. I, I would have so much fun doing that. Thank, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.